Alright guys, so Apple has now officially released another beta for iOS 18.2. Today releasing iOS 18.2 developer beta 4 now of course in this video i wanted to cover some of the latest changes and bug fixes happening with the latest ios 18.2 beta now the download is anywhere from 600 to 900 megabytes that's always going to depend on the device and the software that you're updating from but one thing i do want to mention i want to jump into settings here i want to go under general i want to go into the about section and take a look at the ios version take a look at the latest bill number there it ends with the letter a now typically when we see the letter a towards the end of a beta bill number it means that Apple will soon release the software to the general public and there's two rumored release dates. We'll talk about the release date here in just a couple of minutes. But before we get to that, I want to talk about other software. So iPadOS 18.2 Beta 4 is now available for the iPads as well. macOS 15.2 Beta 4 is also available for the Mac and watchOS 11.2 beta 3 is available for the apple watch now the first thing i want to talk about is one minor change that i've noticed with a banner inside of the new redesign emails application now i'm not quite sure if this is unique to the latest beta 4 but it is the first time that i see it and it says manage batch count only unread messages categorized as primary will appear on the emails icon so basically any new email categorized as primary will show the notification badge on the new emails application with iOS 18.2, all the other categories, which we have four, will not according to this latest banner showing up in the emails application. Now, something else that I did notice after setting up my HomePod, and again, I'm not sure if this is unique to the latest beta, but we now have dark mode icons for music and the new Siri dark mode icon as well throughout the setup process when setting up the home pod so let me know if you've seen this before in those comments down below now one bug fix that i do want to talk about is within messages so i'm happy to report that if you had issues with your stickers not populating properly on your keyboard that has been addressed with the latest ios 18.2 beta 4 so i know many users reported that all their stickers were missing or some stickers were missing and it appears to be addressed and fixed within the latest beta which i'm happy to report and now i quickly want to talk about a feature called battery intelligence which was discovered within the code of ios 18.2 by 9 to 5 mac this feature allows your iphone to determine how how long it will take to charge to 100 however this feature has not been made available just yet this was found within the code of ios 18.2 but apple could make it available with future software update or with future betas who knows but as of right now it is not here just yet perhaps maybe apple will release this with 18.3 or 18.4 who knows or maybe not even at all but it is something that i did want to point out is not here just yet now with all that being said i want to talk about the expected release date for ios 18 18.2 because we're quickly approaching the release date now there's two scenarios that could happen here so next week the last week of november if we get the rc then that means mark german is correct and on december 2nd monday december 2nd we should get the official release for ios 18.2 however if next week on the week of the 25th we do not get the rc and we get another beta the possibilities of ios 18.2 releasing on december the 9th will increase so the two days that are rumored is december 2nd by mark german and december 9th so those two days december 2nd or december 9th either two of those days could be the release date if we do get the rc next week it means december 2nd if we don't and we get the rc on the week of the second then obviously december the 9th will most likely be the release date for the software ios 18.2 and there you guys have it that about brings an end to this video i just wanted to share those quick details with you guys thank you for watching i hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you guys on the next one peace